Hello friends, welcome to Java 2D tutorial. In this video, we will see how to draw lines. The video depends on the previously created video, empty window and watch this video as a prerequisite and now we will continue with the line drawing. So to draw line, we need two point. So in this example, we will draw the line by specifying these two parameters. Then we will draw one more line here. So that means we are going to draw line one and then here one more line, line two. So we already have our uh, stage ready in the previous video code snippet if you see it will show as 1.1 and 1.2 and here we will add the code to perform line drawing so here first we create two line object line and there is one more line and we are storing that line object in two references So first line, if you see, we specify x and y coordinate, x is 12. So in a window, let's say if this is the corner or origin, x is 12 from x, I mean from left, we specify the x that is 12, then y from here it is a 272 so 12 comma not 272 275 that's one point second point in x direction 882 and then 275 so if you see y it is the uh, same but the x is varying from 12 to 882 so this is one line and the second line x if you see it is a 420 and y 50 that means y from here it is 50 let's state and the x 420 from here it is 420 so let's state this is the second line's point x is 420 from here it is 420 and from top it's 50 the same way here if you see for the second line x is not changing 420 the same offset so x is 420 and y if you see Previously, y is 50, right? From here, it is 50. Now, 475. That means I have to come down and this specifies the second coordinate. x, it is 420 and y is 475. So, that's all. So, now we have two line object. The first line object denotes this. Right, so we specified the line object. Then root root we already created, so it's the group node, right? Root dot get children. So this will retrieve us the observable list. So we will be using this uh, collection many times in our uh, uh, complete JavaFX courses. So this will give the nodes our collection of nodes so we call that as a observable list and a type is node so here i'm naming this as the shapes then to this uh, shapes i'm making call to add that means here i'm adding two line object line one and line two that's all after that we are setting title to the stage we are setting scene and we are making call to the show method so
when the scene is shown these two lines will be drawn so if you see here let's go from here primary stage dot show so it will show the stage stage contains scene so stage stage contains so let's state this is the stage in the outer one stage contains the scene and scene contains a group node so this is the root right group node root dot get children and from this get children we are adding two nodes that means these two are children to this group so this is node one and this one is node two so that means we are adding line one that's node one here so let me call this as n1 and n2 so this is n1 and this one is n2 so if you see here it's a simple scene graph the scene graph is uh, the scene is containing a group group contains uh, two nodes n1 n2 so that's what here we established so here we established the scene graph scene graph in the sense of from root we are getting the children and then we add two line object so there is a relation that is established group this group contains two nodes so scene graph is established so now when you make a call to show show will show show is called on this stage stage will make a call to uh, i mean it will uh, uh, go through the scene and when it has the scene it knows the scene graph scene graph is nothing but a group that group contains two nodes when it visits these two nodes it knows that it needs to draw a first line n1 is a line right n2 is one more line so when it reads n1 it performs the first line so whatever is line one so if it is line one it draws this line then when it reads n2 there is one more line l2 it draws that line so that's how the um, uh, java fx uh, uh, works so whether it the node can be anything in the previous part theory part we talked about node right a node can be a 2d or 3d graphics or node can be a user interface element or a node can be a media stream so it can be a video file or audio file whatever it is so for all the thing it visits the node it knows the node type based on that the action will be performed now it's demo time we will go to the demo so we created our first example in the previous we created our so we created our first example in the previous video now we will copy this file click on the package name then do the paste okay refactor copy it will ask us to rename instead of uh, empty window here i am going with the rename option fx2d02 and we will call this as a line drawing click on the refactor so now we have the file copy so everything we no need to delete that comment if i do that uh, here but because i'm going to copy the file and paste right all right so sample 1.1 part of our previous video now we will do the coding convention of a sample 2.12 like that all right here we will export line from javax.scene.shape.line then observable list 
observable list is from java x dot collections dot observable list we will import that as well then we need to import node that's from java x dot scene dot node that's all and now if you read this example we created a group we created a scene we set a color for the scene then we created two nodes line one and line two then from our group node we retrieved the children why because we need to establish a parent child relation right here we said we said get children then we added a line one and line two to this uh, parent so this way we are establishing a scene graph and after that if you see this group was already added to the scene so this is the root we added that to the scene then we are editing this group that means to this group we are adding the children line one and line two all right now here we will rename this as line drawing so now i can do the clean and i can run it and this time you will see two lines in the window this means we are not running the correct project so we will once again rebuild it and we will right click the 0 to then we will choose run file and here you are seeing the line right so this is one line and this one is a second line And if you see here, we are not making any draw method. When we learned about um, um, Java 2D, the time uh, we make use of the graphics 2D, then we make a call to draw method. So the draw method draws the outline and fill method will fill the closer shape. So that's the two method we extensively used when we learned about the Java 2D drawing, right? Here, if you see, there is no such a draw method. All we do is we create the nodes and we attach it to the uh, uh, parent or we establish a scene graph and we will submit the scene graph to the primary stage. Right? That's all. Then when we run the application, this is the entry point. Launch will come into picture. Launch will internally make call to the start method and when it is making such a call it will supply the primary stage and that's it so from here uh, relation is established and primary stage know what needs to be drawn based on the scene graph so we are done with our line drawing thank you for watching bye